And we're back with another episode of Let's Play Final Fantasy VI. I'm your host, Nick Legato. And here we are at Doma. We could have gone to the Coliseum, but no point in doing it now. We, we're going to hit up the... We could hit up the Coliseum. I'll tell you when it's a good idea to do it, because there's a lot of enemies there that would be such extreme luck. It, it would be insane to have to compete in, and there's not enough... Uh, there's not a, there's not enough warrant to go over there and try our luck. Not really. Not right now. Not without some items. And we won't even head there probably until near endgame anyway. Again, so, you know. We'll cover what you should get when we get there. We brought Cyan with us. Because we should have. Though I do think... Yes, it worked. <laughs> Cyan's not waking up. This could actually be a good thing. Oh. <laughs> yes, the end of sign. What was this? The hell? Who gave them pixie sticks? No. It's the Three Stooges! They've invaded a video game! <laughs> There's nothing actually much more disturbing than what we're watching right now. Today we dine well, huh? We're not gonna let- Yeah, you can see actually all of the sprites inside. It's kind of funny. Oh no. As you can see, we're all separate, separated here, so we're gonna save because it's the right thing to do. God damn telemarketers, I'll tell you. They don't, they don't quit, do they? Alright. So we need to get our characters back because as we're by ourselves, we're gonna be in trouble. And I don't want to fight by myself. That's always a bad idea. Especially with Realm. Well, we'll probably be okay. Because we've got the forces of rage on our side. So let's just we'll just go balls out if we're gonna have only Realm in our party. <laughs> Take that! Booyah, motherfucker! <laughs> There's a 9,999 for you. <laughs> uh, my evil laugh is not working out for me today. Oh. Um, let's get our character here. Now I feel a little better since now we have two characters. Oh, there's such a great irony to that, too. <laughs> um, this door. I hate this place. It took me a long time to really figure this out, but ever since I got it the first time, it's pretty hard to screw it up like I just did. Character, caricature is the only caricatures we're gonna have for this. So we have one kind of offensive magical force, physical with physic physicality attached to it. But whatever. Pandora, the only enemy, the only set enemy that actually doesn't have a palette swap. But this is a great enemy for uh, Strago here. This one here, she can use all the weird, crazy ass spells that we could not use before, that he could not use before anyway. So this is what makes this place very interesting for Strago. Ah, dang it. That's not good. Okay, now we're really gonna have to kill him. So he'll learn roulette now, unless he's dead. And one of the pan, one of the critic is gonna die. Or, is that a, no, I'm sorry, it's the critic, the Pandora of the little boxes. I should have known that. Oops! <laughs> oh, but instant death doesn't work on them. <sighs> of course. But raging fire does. So we could use... We could use fire too here. That should work just nicely. Um... This battle isn't really that difficult. I mean, it is difficult because the evil toot does all kinds of random status effects to you, but it's nothing you should really consider to worry about. I mean, it may not hit every, everybody, and if you have um, a ribbon or, you know, something on somebody to protect them, then you'll be fine. Yay, we learned roulette, which we'll never use, unless I really have to. If I really have to, that means I'm desperate! filled up our stock of potions before coming here. Because remember, once you come here, you can't leave. 
Ooh, excuse me. Yeah, you can't leave, so you gotta stay here for the duration, dude. You have to do it. You gotta do it. Okay. Now this is a great way here, now that we're here we can save. I'd rather save with three characters and repeat the entire cycle again, in all honesty. I'd rather do that. So... We, we, you should know what the doors are and what, what takes you to what, so keep that keep that in mind, as one might say. Now that we've done a lot of this stuff already. Um, I'm sure I'm walking into the wrong door now. But we saw this battle. Obviously fire is the way to go. Kill it with fire! Now that I can give you a proper demonstration of how you should handle this battle. Fire 2 and a fire scheme. Surprisingly, I think, I'd like to, I hate to say it, but I think we fought harder dungeons than this one in, in, a, in a way. But, a lot of, there's a lot of status effects, there's a lot of enemies that can do a lot of terrible things to you. Um, so, you know, just make sure you, you're prepared for that. Alright, this way... Now, last time, we went through there, it took us where we didn't want to go. This should take us where we want to go. This is a Barbie, this is a... Uh, now, this is the only place where you'll meet the cr uh, I think the critic. Other than the belt, now that we're here. God damn it. I hate when they do that. You bitch. How dare you start turning my good, cool, kick-ass car- Ah! See, this is one where she's gonna have to learn Imp, because this is gonna be annoying if she doesn't know Imp on her own. So let's remove Imp here. And let's finish, uh, at least finish her off. I want Critic to teach Strago some of the other skills, like pro level, I don't know, whatever. She can use that. She can also, um, surprisingly do, um, another skill. What was it called? Oh, jeez. I think she just did it. Damn it. Well, she didn't do it, but that wasn't what I wanted her to do. Well, let's kill off this Barbie here. Die! Um, luckily Realm avoided that. Let's wake somebody up here. Let's wake Strago up. Since I'd rather him be awake. He has more magic options. Well, maybe not more, but at least different magic options. And, oh, look at that, what a coincidence. <laughs> Go float out a level one now. Well, eh, let's just throw out a heal. Whatever heal, doesn't matter. <laughs> Cure us. We can sit here all day waiting for her to cast the certain skills. Or, if yep, there's level something pearl. <laughs> Based on the amount of gold you have, which is gonna miss anyway. See if we can throw out another one here. Condemn. There we go. So that kind of actually that kind of sums up all the skills that uh, Strago can learn from this. So actually now she's killable. There's only the three: Condemn, Roulette, and Level I don't know Pearl or whatever whatever they want to call it. So we learned that and we learned Condemn. So that means we don't have to stand around and fight this broad anymore. <laughs> Only one door here. Make sure we're all healed up. MP's as good as it's gonna get, really. This bat this battle is pretty weird. Okay, I don't remember which one's which, but it looks I think it's based on the elemental look, so I have to just keep in mind that way. Um there's a couple things that we can do. Um, to help ourselves. First, let's haste ourselves, because, you know, the faster we move, the more pain they suffer. If you hit them with three, eat any of them with three to four spells, they'll, they'll actually start a, putting up a deterrent on you. The one we want to kill first is usually, I think it's Curly. I forget which one Curly is, which doesn't help my scenario. You can throw out a, bah a Bahamut to damage them all significantly. There we go, there's a good hit right there, haha. <laughs> We can slow, we want to slow 
Curly down, because Curly's going to throw some nasty spells at us. But on top of that, he can resurrect the other two. I think. I think that's him. Yeah, Curly's the one that resurrects him, but you can't. I can't tell which one's which. No! Well, there goes that idea. Um, Item-wise, what do I have here? Don't I have a... Uh, echo screen or... Yeah, there it is. Go. Problem served. Um, now the question is, what do you want to hit him with? None of this stuff really works very well, so we'll just use standard magic. So we'll hit him with ice two again. He hasn't cast reflect yet, which is pretty good. Which is a good thing. We don't have any ice throwing here, but look at he's down now, so we can now actually throw. You know, we should throw individual like the ninja star. Um, I would go for. The one on the left next, and they, you know what? They didn't get a chance to use their delta attack, which is interesting. <laughs> um, uh-oh. He has uh, locked himself in. So now we're kind of even lower on options here. Uh, and then the one on the right doesn't really have a weakness, so we're going to have to do something here. I don't have the spell, do I? No, I do not, but we can put... Berserk on him. You can use stuff like Grand Train here that bypasses uh, his ability to hit you reflect. But we don't have, yeah, we don't have the spell, which is too hard to learn at the moment. Um, so, well, we can summon Palador as an option. And there goes uh, Curly. Lag. Lag fixed. I don't know why it's doing that. I'm not doing anything in the background this time. I know I'm not doing anything in the background. <laughs> well, Mo doesn't have a shield on him, but Mo is a, is immune to all uh, elements that I know of. So, you know, that can make him kind of the most annoying. But, as you can see, we won the battle. Not a hard battle. It can be, though. If you don't kill him off quickly, it can be a nasty battle. Definitely not, well, at least I could say definitely not in your favor. She needs these spells so badly, it's sad. Um, well, we'll just put that on her for now. Okay, rather than put Bahamut, though, I'd rather put Bahamut, but when he's done with that, so let's put something else on him that would be useful at level up. Um, you know, Bahamut, actually put Bahamut on him, but it doesn't really make sense to do that. Try, nah, he needs Tritop. Oh, and I left it on, um, Setzer, damn it. Oh well. Not a big deal. We can, not a big deal. He's got other stuff he has to learn anyway. I would prefer to see him learn anyway. <laughs> you can work on float. And healing here. And you are on Paladore, but you're done with Paladore, right? So you can move to... Oh, jeez. Either Starlord or Bahamut. Bahamut. For now. And then when Realm learns both Siren and Stray, she can work on that. Then she can work on Bahamut. Though, Realm with Bahamut is very, very lethal. Oh, no. Cyan, you're not dreaming about this place, are you? No. So next time on Let's Play Final Fantasy VI, more of Cyan's dream. At least we don't have to play as him. <laughs> oh, we're so I'm so glad I don't have to play as him through this dream sequence. It would piss me off. So we'll see you when we come back.